I have been on the squad almost four years. Six years now. 1998. For seven years. For over a year. For five years now. Over 1971. And uh, for me, it's always my first calls that I remember. I was called to an um, event where a person had collapsed in a field. You try to mentally prepare yourself, but for a call like that where you are literally trying to bring someone back to life and, and everything like that, is, it will stick with you for a long time. I want to be there to help folks in what is really a trying time. And for some people, it's the most difficult time of their lives. You see the goodness in people, you see the darkness in people, you see, uh, you see people when they're at their lowest in their life. We're not gonna throw you into something that you're not capable of handling. You know, we don't ask more of anybody than they can give. I've seen too many people going on their first calls over my years that are jittering all over the place because they're too worried about what they're going to have to do. And in order to get good, in order to be good at what you do, you don't think about it, you just do it. Uh, members and other EMTs or cadets in the high school can tell other people what it's like, what they do, but no one's really going to know until they actually step in and dive headfirst into it. And I, I can tell you that everybody who started here was probably unsure until they actually tried. I fell in love with it. Um, it's not for everyone, but you'd be surprised how you are able to help people when they need it.